Concerned clergy and community leaders met today to address the ongoing crisis at the Oklahoma County Detention Center. They also called for some specific actions to improve the current state of the jail, including the resignation of Jail Trust Administrator Greg Williams. Ashley Moss joins us to explain. Ashley. Well, Greg Williams did not step down. Instead, the Oklahoma County Jail Trust, they managed the jail, released statements on his behalf supporting him staying on the job, and that's when things heated up. Not in his leadership. The situation as a jail has not only failed to improve over the last two years, it has, by all metrics, worsened. It's obvious that we need to go in a different direction. The call and response from this group of pastors and community leaders saying it's not about if Greg Williams should leave, but why he would be allowed to stay. Rikers Island has a death rate at 2.8 deaths per 1,000, and ours has a rate of 8.2. Per 1,000. The jail trust quickly came back with comments sent on behalf of Mr. Williams. The statement saying, while some problems are not solvable in the current building, he's focused on improving conditions and operations. Also sending a statement of support, jail trust chair Jim Couch, adding that Williams has provided excellent service under difficult circumstances, especially to the detainees and staff at the jail, and his management has led to, quote, material improvements and conditions, reversing decades of neglect in the facility. But in a scathing response, jail trust member and pastor Derek Scobie said Couch's comments were dismissive and didn't represent all jail trust members. And, quote, everyone except Mr. Couch, it seems, understands that despite Mr. Williams' best efforts, he has proven himself incapable of doing the job up to our standards. That job, managing the daily operations for a jail, infamous for allegations of abuse and neglect, with 14 jail deaths recorded as of today, as many as died in all of 2021. The criticism here is levied at the jail administrator. That the jail trust must find new leadership. Now we've got all three statements from Jim Couch, Greg Williams, and Derek Scobie on our website, as well as a full recap of that press conference. You can find it all on k4.com.